Hey peeps, what's up? I have this video with this young girl. She get pregnant when she a 13 year old and she married to a lady when she a 17. Boy, this is a story a bigger than me, guy. Let's listen to it. What most people don't know is I was married. I was married to a woman. And I met her at my first job. Oh. I was 16. I didn't meet her until I turned 18. Well, I was 17, turning 18. And the purpose of me telling you this is to let you know that God can and will deliver you from anything that you want to be delivered from. So true. Key word, you have to want it. You can't say something or you can't talk about something if you're not really about it or you don't really want the help. It is not easy for me to come out and say this to anyone. True. Because when I look back and to know what I know today, it is not easy to say any of this. I don't care. You can judge me all you want. By all means, keep on judging. When I was in that relationship, I wasn't happy. Honestly, to be honest with everyone, she was there to help me with my daughter. She was there when I needed to go to work. And I, I took things further than what it should have. Everyone always asked me, why were you with her? What is it about her? My response would be, she was there for me when I needed someone there for my child. And I felt like I owed her something. Whoa. Because when she was there, other people weren't there for me. Whoa. So I always felt like I owed her something, like I, I could be her punching bag because that's what I later turned into. True. Because I went through so much, the physical, mental, everything, abuse. Believe it. And I never knew that I would go enter into any of that. And I wasn't happy. So I started getting closer to God. And it's it's something about when you go through those hard times or when when you're down on your knees and when you, you just feel hopeless. And all throughout the years that I was with her because I wasn't happy at all. There would be times where, be up, and then straight down. It's like I was with someone, and I can say this today, and I don't care. If she see this, she hear, it's the truth. She was jealous of me. And I said, God, how can someone be jealous of me when they see and they know so much about me? You know the things that were up against me but did not prosper. Sometimes the people that are closest to you really be the most envious of you. And that's hurtful for me to even say. And all the signs will be present because they were all present when I was in that relationship, situationship, actually, because there was so much. I was going through the motions, mentally drained in all areas. I was drained, pulling all the weight. I said, God, like, I'm tired. And I had my grandmother. Now, what people don't know. When you have someone that leads you to Christ, you cherish those people. And I thank God for my grandmother because even my grandmother, she's a real woman, a real Christian. She was because she's no longer here. She met my ex-wife and she told me, she said, Ashley, you know, my grandmother pulled me aside and said, Ashley, you know, that's not who God wants you to be with. And I looked at her. Boy, I really and truly, you really got you a lot, my girl, because if you get pregnant for your 13 year old, and it come in like when you get pregnant, nobody not did it for help you and all these things. So sometimes you see some person end up in a some situation because of where they got you. You understand? Because if she 13 and get pregnant, you know she a little, little girl. You see me, I say. But sometimes, to be honest, you know, sometimes. And them put themselves in another situation there. 
You understand? Because they are little girl, you should not think about no sex and them something. They should not think about your schoolwork and all these things. But as me say, you can't really bash her. You understand? Because they're young and things may happen. You see me, I say? But in an easy master, some situation lead you to a next situation. <laughs> situation lead you to a next situation. You try to run for one, but at the same time, you're running our next one. You understand what I try to say? Boy, it's not easy. Trust me. I said yes, ma'am. Man. She said, I just want to make sure you know that. 